Hello, my name is Brandy, aka Pixelated Twix, and if you're new here, welcome to my little corner. And if you're an OG, welcome back. I am doing a little cast video here for Keo Sims. Well, I created this sim for her, and it is my sim self. And I guess this is the perfect time for me to celebrate 100 subscribers. I just want to take time to say thank you to all of you who decided to, you know, come and watch and comment and like. You guys have been so supportive, and I appreciate every last one of you. You're a member of my family now. So let's sit down, grab a snack, so I can give you guys a little tea on my sim self. Ready? Let's go. All right. So her name is Brandy Nicole. And she is really a pixelated representative of who I am in a more simplistic fashion. I'm more complex, obviously, than this sim because she only has three traits. And I have so many different uh, aspects that I couldn't include in, uh, include. So, I chose three things, and if I can remember correctly, I know I chose Bookworm, because I love to read, and I may have chosen, I don't know, Foodie, Creative, Writer. I know writing, I believe, was my, uh, my aspiration. I've always wanted to be a writer since... I was very, very young. I wrote in every single notebook I can find around the house. My mother used to yell at me because I would go through school supplies uh, writing. So uh, that is my aspiration is to write a book one day. So uh, this sim is definitely a writer. Uh, she enjoys life to its fullest. She loves to have uh, friends and family around, but she's also a bit of an introvert. Um, she likes to shut down and be by herself, and those that um, are in her life understand that. Um, if they don't hear from her for a few days or a few weeks, uh, they know that, uh, yeah, she's... Um, in her mood so leave her alone and she'll come around uh, that is me in real life guys all right so where is Brandy Nicole from well she is a city girl with a country heart uh, she is from Shy Rock Shy Town Shiberia the shy so she enjoys a good pizza pie um a good deep dish pizza she enjoys chicago style popcorn and what is chicago's chicago style popcorn well it's a mix of caramel and cheddar yes uh she also enjoys going to portillo's for a good hot dog um and she likes to hang out downtown on uh, 35th every now and then because we all know high class shopping is done on 35th and she uh, just likes to hang out on the magnificent mile every now and then um when she's feeling a little bougie because she is a slightly bougie sim and what do i mean by bougie for those of you in the back uh she likes the finer things in life every now and then she splurges on things that matter to her not necessarily um clothes but she enjoys expensive soaps and good perfume and high class body lotion why because she loves to take care of herself she doesn't necessarily believe in spending money on clothing items but the things that you know make her melanin glow <laughs> i don't have as much melanin as i'd like but you know um the melanin i do have i like to take care of you know it's that god given what my mother calls high yellow melanin. 
<laughs> so anyway, um, she is pretty laid back, kind of goofy. I wish I could have included that because I am goofy myself. Um, so she likes to laugh and, in like I said, enjoy life. Uh, she doesn't take herself too seriously, but when she is serious, she can be very serious. Um, so that's a little bit about me or do you want to know more let me know comment below if you guys would like to learn more about me but yes i decided to create her for keo sims uh, let's play and i have created a sim self before but every now and then you need a new uh, you need a refresher, right? You need a new, new sim. And so I decided to create her. Um, as you can see, she is thicker than cold grits, <laughs> which, you know, I like my shape. And so uh, I had to represent in game because representing for the curvy girls out there, um, embrace who you are and what God gave you. Um, show them what your mama gave you, right? Uh, so being that she is a curvy girl, um, she rocks the skinny jeans quite a bit because they're the only ones that really fit her body. Um, and she does tend to get a little self-conscious sometimes, like I do. And so every now and then you may catch her just in some sweatpants, in a t-shirt, uh, or oversized t-shirt and some jeans to hide her shape. It's just normal. I have those days every now and then. Today is one of them. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so she is a loving Sim. She cares about people. She is a cheerleader for the world. Uh, she tries to see uh, the positive and everyone, uh, which tends to get her heart broken quite a bit. So if you play with the Sim, be mindful that um, she can be a little standoffish at first, uh, even though she she wishes that everyone was good. She realizes that uh, through life, um, that's just well she realizes that from experience that everyone isn't good everyone's intentions are um aren't good so uh she can easily uh or she doesn't trust as quickly as she used to when she was younger but uh she still sees the world uh through rose colored glasses every now and then so um just be mindful that she is a little sensitive she cries quite easily <laughs> uh, but now speaking of mistrust she is a single sim I'm not single in real life but she is single and she's looking for a guy uh, a sim male a smell <laughs> um, that would understand her mood swings, um, would understand her sensitivity, uh, would understand her standoffish ways, and sometimes her shy ways because she is a little shy. It takes her a minute to warm up to people. Um, and that's just how she's been since she was very young. Uh, it doesn't mean that she is unsocial uh, or unsociable. Uh, she is a social sim, but um, she just likes to observe people before she jumps into the fray, so to speak. Um, and she does tend to keep a small circle of friends. You won't see her around a ton of people. Um, just her uh, choice in friendship is a little more calculated, I guess, than it would have been years ago. Uh, before, she thought everyone was her friend. Now she's learning that she has to kind of um, pick her friends wisely. And that's just a lesson she has learned in life. 
Anyway, so a little bit more about her backstory. Um, as you can see, I kept her makeup very, very neutral, which is something that I uh, am in real life. I don't wear a lot of makeup, not normally at home. I wear my glasses, I'm in my sweatpants, or I'm in some shorts and a t-shirt, what have you. So I keep her pretty low key. However, when she goes out, she does tend to like to dress up. She likes to put in on a little makeup. Um, well, bronzer, <laughs> mascara, lip gloss and if she's feeling froggy she will put on some highlighter um, and she will forgo the glasses because she hates wearing her glasses which is why she's blind to this day um, true life guys true life um, but she does like frilly dresses and uh, cutesy tops when she goes out but other than that, she's a good mix of tomboy and girly and geek light. So she will don a Fallout 4 t-shirt or, um, I don't know, uh, a Care Bear t-shirt. Uh, so she's still a child at heart. Um, Yes, but like I said, when she goes out, she likes to really get dressed up because this is the time that she can hang out with her girls or even just enjoy the city by herself. Um, and yes, yeah, she is in the city, but her heart is in the country because she spent a lot of her childhood in the country with her grandparents so her dream would be to move back to the country and possibly have a little farm where she can have a few animals and you know write in her free time um and you know maybe meet the country guy of her dreams and raise a family and have a few dogs and what have you so yeah that is her story <laughs> i hope you enjoyed it <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Of course, if you've made it this far and you're not a part of the family, don't be shy. Smash that subscribe button and hit the bell so you don't miss an upload because I upload every week. Uh, also, if you'd like to see more content like this, definitely uh, comment below and give me a like so I know that uh, these are videos that you uh, appreciate. And speaking of appreciation, I do thank you for stopping by. You've been amazing. I will see you later. Ciao.